I had a couple of key people. Uh, Arthur Price, who was there from the beginning, who did the business affairs, which meant he dealt with the networks, I mean the money part of the thing. Uh, he he uh, dealt with them and, he, and, the, and the talent. And uh, I, 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 will, I will say that, I, I've said this before, I didn't invent it, but somebody said it to me. He was the best number two guy in, in broadcasting and production. And he turned out to be a terrible number one later on. But he was very good at what he did. And, and not long after, this, this was just before the dramatic period, and this man played a big part in, in the conversion. I hired Stu Irwin, who, had, who was at Universal. Actually, I hired him for the fourth time in my life. Once I hired him from CBS to Benton and Bowles, and then I hired him at Universal. I hired him, and then I hired him at uh, MGM and later at a company called GTG. He was the son of a famous father. His, fa his father was an actor, and his, and his mother and father had one of the very early television situation comedies. Um, and, and he's a terrific guy. Uh, now retired and living in, uh, in San Diego. And those two guys, Stu on the dramatic side, particularly relating to Stephen and Bruce, Bochco and Paltrow, and, uh, and some others, um, and Arthur doing the business affairs. So, that, so there was a sort of a tri-cornered thing that worked. And uh, it, it gave me the chance to do whatever I wanted to do. And what I wanted to do mostly was hang out with the creative people. And that's what I did.